This is going to be interesting to anyone. But we went to Trader Joe's. And Trader Joe's is like over an hour away from where we live. So it's always a special treat when we get to go to Trader Joe's. So I figured I'll show y'all what we got. Um, let's start with the cheese puff, the reduced fat cheese puff. When me and David were on Weight Watchers a million years ago. David's right here. Say hi, honey. Um, when we were on Weight Watchers a billion years ago, we got introduced to these, so they're just supposed to be less fattening, um, cheese puffs, and they are very, very good. And we got three bags. No, correction, David got three bags. It feels like a lot to do. Okay, so then... I got some pull apart cheddar jalapeno bread. Look how delicious that looks. Um, we are having a little birthday party here on Saturday for David. He's turning 34. And I feel like these are perfect. I got two as like a party snack appetizer. Um, I got a barbecue seasoned white chicken salad for lunch tomorrow because I have to go into the office. So there's that. David got these. So we were just saying how if there was a Trader Joe's near us, it would kind of suck. Not kind of suck, but it would be probably bad for us because all we do is buy snacks there. But anyways, um, David got the chocolate, chocolatey coated chocolate chip cookie dunkers. And I guess, can you see? And they're like shaped like long ways. So they're easier to like dunk in the milk. Did you see if we had milk? We do. And then I got crunchy chili onion hummus for the party. And then I got pulled pork with red sauce tamales. Mm -mm, I'm probably gonna have one today. So not one bag down okay so we got these mini chicken tacos for the party i want to do minimal cooking as possible um i think we're gonna probably order pizza and just have like little snacks um we got corn and cheese arepas mm -mm, i do love an arepa and then these are my favorite wontons. Another Weight Watchers find um, because they're good on Weight Watchers and they're just like really tiny mini wontons. And they're just so delicious. So I got three bags and I love these. Love, 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 love. So I guess I can't really judge your Cheetos because I got the wontons. Um, we got the mini ice cream vanilla cones. I'm telling you right now, we have to go in September to Trader Joe's again because they come out with a pumpkin flavor of these and it is so good. I think it's actually pumpkin ginger. Yeah. It is delicious. The best ice creams and they're so cute and they're so small and just the best. So we try to go every year around the fall just so we can get the pumpkin ginger. It's so good. And then another Weight Watchers thing. I found these when I was on Weight Watchers. They're turkey corn dogs. Delicious. They taste just like corn dogs and they're delicious. And they're made out of turkey. Turkey is supposed to be healthier, right? Like in general? Yeah, yeah. Okay. And we already broke into these in the car. These are dark chocolate covered marshmallows, light and fluffy marshmallows drenched in dark chocolate. They were so good. 
And then another thing we already broke into are these sour cream glazed donuts. I love sour cream glazed donuts. I think they are so delicious. Um, and I just could not. I saw them there. I'm like, oh, they're so good. I just I had to get them. They were delicious. I wish they were a little softer. Um, you know who has really good like sour cream? I think they call them like old fashioned donuts is Wawa. I love their old fashioned donuts. And then last but not least, I got two seasonings. One is a salmon rub. I love salmon, it's my favorite fish to eat. Um, so I thought this was super cute. And I feel like aesthetically, like Trader Joe's seasoning is aesthetically pleasing. And then I also got an onion salt. I follow Sarah Vargas on YouTube and I'm pretty sure it was her. I'm like 75.5% sure that she said like this is her favorite seasoning is the onion salt. You probably can't see it from Trader Joe's. So I got that. I kind of want to smell it. And I love her and I just, I feel like I just trust her cooking suggestions. Mm. I just smell the salmon one now that we're here. Okay. Interesting. It almost smells like. Oh, it's the brown sugar and the paprika. Mm, it smells good. It almost tastes, some, for some reason, it almost tastes, it almost smells kind of barbecue. I think it's the um, smoked paprika that's giving, obviously the smoked flavor, but. Oh, yeah. It's good. Nice. Delicious. Let's we'll, we'll get some salmon now. I know. We, in my head, I keep saying that we need to get better at, like, cooking. We've been really bad at that, like, just cooking. You're looking at me giving like sideways I eyes. I just cooked lunch today. Yeah, but I think in general, like we're not at this point in time, not meal prepping, which we should. That's because I just, sometimes I just feel like all you want to meal prep is sausage and peppers. No, I and not I want it. flashbacks <laughs> to like eating that so much. So, it wasn't good. A couple years ago, That's we amazing. went on keto. I did lose a ton of weight. Um, gained it all back and then some but one of our like favorite meal parts at the time was like a sausage and pepper and we thought it was the most delicious thing until we had it too many times and now it's just we had it too many thought times of it. and we started to make it lazy so like we used to buy like fresh peppers and cut yeah. them up and then like that slowly snowballed into like frozen knockoff non-name brand peppers and it was just that it was just mush it wasn't the same it wasn't good it wasn't the same but that's all the stuff we got Ooh. that's all the stuff we got at trader joe's i hope that was super interesting um i know i like watching hauls but that's probably just because i just like i'm nosy and want to know what other people buy but Hi, it is super dark and cozy. I'm actually working from home today and it is raining, but I did. I am on a candle making journey. <laughs> I would love to start a small business, so I thought making candles would be awesome sauce. A lot harder than it looks. Um, I cannot get the formula. Mm. It's like a ghost story. I cannot get the formula right. So I feel like my candles are not smelling as strong as like they should or that I want them to. And I haven't, I've been so frustrated with it um, that I've kind of ignored it for the last month because I'm just like, I can't, I can't. Um, but I want to start getting back into it and just trying and just accepting the fact that some things just take a little bit of practice and I just need to do that. It's practice. So I figured it's cozy. I lit one of my candles and I think I'm gonna read um a book i'm working from home today i'm actually on lunch i made some cilantro wontons from trader joe's and i'm gonna start the my book club book so i think that's what we're gonna do it just feels like i wish i could just take a nap but i only get an hour break so that's not happening 
David just came home. He didn't know the candle was on and he said he could smell it. I was just telling the vlog that I feel like I can't get my candles to smell and he said he could smell it and it has a really like good, um, let me flip this around. Like it's an even burn pool. I didn't cut the wick, which I should have, but eh. This is a peach magnolia. He's like, yeah, he came in and he was like, oh, it smells good in here. And I'm like, really? Like what? And he was like, like citrusy. And I'm like, that's my candle. I just feel like so happy. <laughs> you made my day, honey. Ooh, I do? Yeah. Ooh, okay. Hopefully yeah. the scratch off makes my day. I know. Hopefully you're a two million dollar winner. Mm, don't hold your breath. <gasps> Just 20 characters. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I went to Target, get stuff for David's party. So I figured since we did the Trader Joe's haul to show you guys what I got at Target for the party. Um, I got a, are you guys far away? Come close, come close, come hither. Okay, is that better? I feel like that's better. Um, I feel like you guys were like really far away before. I got a like already cut up charcuterie board. I get the same one at Aldi's for my book club. Um, I It's probably cheaper at Aldi's than at Target, but I was surprised when I saw it there. Um, and it's really good. So, got a charcut. Um, I got this little rice crispy. It's not rice, it's quinoa. Chocolate quinoa crisps and milk chocolate. Um, I got two makeup things while I was there. A new halo glow, a new halo liquid glow filter, and the halo glow blush wand. I use the halo glow liquid filter every single day, um, and I just started using the contour wands, and I like. So I got the blush to try that out. Um, what I got these jalapeno cream cheese wontons. We bought these for a game night we had with some friends a couple of ooh, a couple of weeks ago, and they were delicious, delicious. So I got two of these, two of the same ones for the party. Um, I got some smart sweets, snacks. I'm a snacker, I already had one in the car. Um, and then some decor. So I got this like little green streamer thing for our entryway. Um, so like our house is set up, like it's an open kitchen living room area. Like it's one room. Um, but you have to walk down the hallway from the front door to get it to it. So I'm just gonna like cover that doorway with this. So when people come in, they have to like Go through that fit, that'd be fun. David's favorite color is green, so like that is perfect. I got happy birthday in gold and like silver. And then I got some happy birthday plates and then a little cake. We're not actually having cake. Um, I actually asked David's mom to make apple pie. David doesn't really like birthday cake, um, but he loves apple pie. Um, so she agreed to make some for him. So she's gonna bring that over, I think, Saturday morning? Friday night or Saturday morning. Um, so that's his birthday apple pie, so. And then I am trying the poppy. I've never had the poppy sodas before. It says for a healthy gut. I want a healthy gut. I don't know. Um, I follow Alexandra Rodriguez on YouTube and I'm pretty sure she said I feel like I forget, like I watch so much like YouTube, usually it's like YouTube, TikTok, um, reels and stuff that I forget where I hear things. But I'm pretty sure she said that the grape one tastes just like grape soda, so I'm excited to try that. Um, and that's it, that's all I got. It was 100 bucks. 
It does not look like $100 worth of things, though. I'll tell you that. Like, literally. $100. Inflation. Anywho, um, David's actually at the movies today. He went with a friend. So I am probably gonna make myself some dinner. You okay, Tuck? I'm just gonna lounge, kind of relax. Bye.